Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. This is day 92 of our free IAFIA campaign year 2021. And uh, as we mentioned earlier, we have started doing a round of offices and um, the, the, the government offices, the other commercial offices, um, universities and um, markets, mosques and playgrounds. And we are distributing the pamphlets which tell people how they can participate in the Afia Freedom Campaign. So today we have come over here uh, to the Evacuate Trust Complex that is in F6 Islamabad. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very, very nice building. See? And um, it's right next to the Marriott. And we stood at the gate over here distributing pamphlets, but I am really, really, really disappointed to see the response of people. A much better response was given by the female students of Islamic University as compared to them. As I was standing here, what I could think of was Surat Takasur. Al Hakumut Takasur, Hatta Zurtumul Makabir, Kalla Saufat Alamun, Summa Kalla Saufat Alamun, Kalla Laut Alamuna Ilmal Yaqeen, Latarabun Al Jaheem, Summa Latus Aluna, Yoma Izin, Anin Naim. Surely Allah will ask you about the blessings you had. You had the blessing of freedom, and you had, which Afia does not have right now, and you had the freedom of uh, time. You could give Afia Siddiqui a little time, but you know, uh, most of the people who I've tried to give pamphlet to, they're just in such a hurry. People are rushing in and out of the complex and saying, sorry, we're in a hurry. And I'm just handling them, handing them over a pamphlet. They can just take it and put it in their pocket and read it later on. But they are in so much of a hurry. Forward, al hakum al So, uh, never have I understood the meaning of the surah so well as I've understood today. So Allah will surely ask us about the blessings Allah has given us of our freedom, of time, money, resources, everything that we have at our disposal. If nothing else, this mobile that we are using all the time, all we have to do is, if nothing else, we don't want to do any extra effort for Afia. What we can do is go to the citizens portal every day or at least every weekend and make a request for Afia Siddiqui's freedom. That's the least we can do for her. And if we can't even do this much, then surely Allah will ask us about the uh, blessings Allah had given us and we did not utilize them to work towards a cause worthy of attention and that's the test that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is putting this nation uh, uh, in because see there's a very clear connection between the lockdown that we have gone through for the past one and a half year and the fact that Afia Siddiqui is still in lockdown for the last 18 years and so is Kashmir and so is Palestine and so are so many Muslims in China. So what are we going to do about them? Are we just going to carry on with our lives or are we going to do make some struggle for them? So inshallah, we'll make some struggle for them and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will unlock this lockdown for us. Inshallah. Ameen.